Well, I'm here at the Brookfield Zoo with Pat and Cat. Uh, they've been nice enough to bring me in to let me talk to some of the local students here from two of the different schools. And uh, we have a full STEM-based education curriculum integrated into all of our great white shark research. Which we're trying to make science cool again for students. We started our research back in 2007, and I can remember at that time, you know, it was just about was it even possible to capture the ocean's giants and give the leading scientist 15 minutes of access to them and then let them go alive and leverage technology to, for the first time in history, figure out where they're breeding and where they're giving birth so we can save their future. And it's really evolved from just trying to accomplish that to advanced fundamental knowledge in science to now a fully open sourced uh, global charismatic research project that's becoming an ocean movement with an education program, a public safety program, obviously the science program, and all of that together has just become really powerful. Well, the ocean affects all of our lives. There is no robust path forward for the planet without a healthy ocean. And the sharks are the balance keepers. They are what keeps the ocean healthy. So when we're able here to leverage, you know, the cool factor of the sharks for education, we're also creating awareness for the students to understand they need to be thinking and have ocean on the brain. They need to be thinking in a practical, data-driven, centrist way about how we're going to treat the planet because soon it'll be their turn to look after it. So yeah, after we talk to the kids today, they're going to be able to look on their phones or go to osearch.org and follow all of our great white sharks and tiger sharks in real time and track them right beside the scientists and see this whole puzzle unfold and be part of it. You know, inclusion is inspiring. And so we try to be as inclusive as we can. They'll be able to track the sharks in real time, download free educational curriculums to do science and math and engineering problems based on those real time dynamic data sets the sharks are laying down with their tracks. And so it's just the beginning of the relationship with students when we talk to them for the first time. From now on, they're gonna be part of our world where when we go on expedition, we're pumping out videos in real time. They can watch on their phone, and then they can immediately go to the tracker and track the sharks on their phone. And then they go to school on Monday and do their math and science curriculums around those real dynamic tracks. It's, it's education in the now, it's relevant, it's current. We're making science cool again.